Okay, this is the Young's Tino suspension. And in order to remember that, I have a young kid here who's looking through a keyhole. And the keyhole is important because it's essentially taking the tibialis anterior tendon and rerouting it through a keyhole that you drill in the navicular. Okay, this moves the tibialis anterior more proximally, making it more of a strong supporter of the longitudinal arch. In addition to that, you advance the PT tendon to the plantar navicular as well. So you're cr creating a nice cradle with soft tissue tendon transfers of the arch. And then finally, of course, you can do an Achilles tendon lengthening. Now, uh, in addition to that, you need to remember that this is primarily a sagittal plane correction. And that makes sense because you're uh, transferring two tendons that directly dorsiflex in the sagittal plane. Um, it's also used for children over the age of 10, which is another reason why this child is here. It's the young keyhole tenosuspension, suspension. And it's for patients also with a naviculocuneiform fault, of course, because it's uh, more strongly dorsiflexing at that joint. Um, it also plantar flexes the first ray, which of course is another sagittal plane correction. Okay, so again, it's the Young's Keyhole Tino Suspension, all right, and it's a sagittal plane correction for pes planus, and that's it.